stay the night. I just wanna take the time. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Roxy Bennett, for those of you who are new. Today I'm gonna be reviewing and trying on, styling this headband wig from Asteria Hair. So they sent me their kinky straight headband wig. This wig is 18 inches long. And as you guys see, it has a nice, beautiful, kinky texture here and it's so soft right now and this is definitely giving me like natural hair vibes I decided to go with this one because as you guys can see my hair is definitely natural on the you know kinkier side so I, I think that it's gonna look more realistic with my hair and everything that I have going on here so as you guys know it's the headband wig so it has it comes with three clips at the top here and it has an elastic band strap right here with a velcro so that you can tie it around the back you guys seen this all over youtube it's a quick and easy way to style your hair without having to use lace or glue or add any track but i slicked down my hair using the even edge um, edge tamer and this thing here is like it works like magic I really just want to show you how well this edge tamer works and how slick back my hair is I'm gonna slick my hair all the way back maybe about halfway just to make sure everything is slicked I'm gonna bring it back that far so look at this and it has like a really good hold I've never seen anything like this before <laughs> so I'm just gonna continue doing that um, to the other side in the middle of course so we can you know work this quick and easy style it took no time for me to slick my hair down so now I'm just gonna put on the wig so it comes with three wig clips that's what's going to be supporting your hair and keeping the wig on for the most part so I'm just gonna snap them open So as long as these three wig clips are in the middle of my head, it's pretty much centered. There's also two wig clips at the back. I didn't realize that, but I don't have any here at the back, so I'm not gonna be using them at all. So once I place it down and it's to my liking, I think I wanna carry it back a little bit further because I want some of my hairline to show. There we go. I think that's a little bit better. I love to see when the hairline is showing and when the natural hair is showing. It just makes it look more realistic. It makes it look a lot better. All right, so I'm just putting on the Velcro strap at the back. So now that I actually put the wig on, when I really think about it, to, put, to slick back my hair and then throw the headband wig on. I would say it took about five to seven minutes. The hair is so full and so soft. Like it, it's giving me like a relaxed look, like a super relaxed look or almost even like a blow dried look to be honest. So we're done, but we're not really done because they sent me a few headbands to go with the style. I think these headbands are perfect for fall, especially the colors and the texture. But there are these four headbands here. They also sent this scarf here. And you guys know, besides using this on this headband wig, we're gonna, I'm gonna have a lot of other uses for it. You already know we need our head scarves, especially because, you know, sometimes those go missing. You need it to tie down your hair, slick down, hold on your edges. Or in the packaging, they also sent some eyelashes 
which I thought was an extra plus. I can definitely appreciate that. And these are lashes that I would definitely wear. I mean, like, look at these ones I have on. So this is definitely a bonus. Thank you so much, Asteria Hair. So I really wanted to try and curl this kinky straight wig just to see if I can get a different style out of it. I know it's 100% humid hair, so it can definitely curl, but I just want to see, you know, the result that I'm going to get. So I'm going to be using... <clears throat> this red by kiss curling wand and I've had this for years now so it's just something that I took out of my toolkit but I'm really curious to see you know how this hair curls guys look how pretty this is wow look at that what do you guys think should we just do the whole thing and see what the end result is I think so okay so this is how it looks after I've curled everything something tells me that okay first of all I love it but something tells me that if I like separate it and fluff it out, it's gonna give me like more volume, of course. But I don't know if I'm gonna like it like that, so I'm just gonna leave it like this for now. And the good thing is that I can, you know, put it up, take it up off my head and put it in a ponytail. Because the back is just covered with the headband. Something tells me this is gonna look really good if I separate it and kind of fluff it out more. So I'm just gonna do that a little bit just to give it more of a deep wave kind of look. Cause these curls are really pretty and the texture of the hair just makes it look so full and a lot more realistic to my hair. All right, so I literally got two styles in one out of this wig. So curl my hair, it took me about 20 to 25 minutes, which was worth the time because like, look at the transformation, right? I'm telling you guys, do not sleep on these headband wigs. It doesn't matter if your hair is really short, look how short my hair is. It can definitely be done. You can still leave out some of your hair at the front here so that it looks more, you know, realistic. It doesn't look too wiggy or anything like that. No lace, no glue. Like where, where are we going wrong here? We can't go wrong with this, okay? If you guys like this look, don't forget to give me a thumbs up, okay? Okay. <laughs> like I mentioned earlier, this wig is from Asteria Hair. Check out my description box below for more details on the exact unit. And I'll also leave a link to the curling wand if you wanna get, if you wanna achieve this kind of deep wave look. Thank you guys so much for watching this video, tuning into my channel. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new. And as usual, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.